All right, Leo, um, it cut off on me before I could finish, so you're going to have a short part two. So your person could be the one, but they could be in a marriage or um, a life partnership or something of that nature. Um, these people could be married or committed to each other. But in order for you guys to get into a relationship, this person has to release this person first. Um, or this could be you or you both could be in this situation. But you guys get need to get to know each other. Um, there could be language barriers, communication, where you guys uh, talk very little to each other. Um, if you're having any communication at all, um, your person could be um, blocking communication or their person could be blocking your person's communication or vice versa or both. Um, I feel like where communication is, cer is concerned, um, your person wants you to come forward and start the conversation, but let your friends help you. Ask for and accept support from others so you're being requested to get your friends in involved, involved in this. Some of you, new love is going to come through. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings, so some of you could be seeing this towards the fall, um, towards the end of the year. For some of you, um, for others of you, this is going to be your person come back uh, washed and new is what I heard. Um, that's not for everybody. What else can you tell me for Leo and love? What is their final outcome at the present time? Um, some of you, this is an unrequited love. There's not enough uh, chemistry or attraction here to keep this relationship going. So there could be because there's a wedding here or they're already in another uh, situation. Or there could be multiple people that this person is just never going to settle down. Um, this person could be uh, too broken. I heard broken. Uh, broken and damaged in order to be a part of your life or you theirs. And finances and career could be an issue for your person or you or you both. Somebody doesn't feel stable. We have religious factors. Everybody is getting this. So um, I even saw in the reading where your person thinks you're a witch or a warlock. Either you think this of them or they think this of you because somebody uh, practices their spirituality. Say, for instance, you may have an IG channel or a Twitter channel or an Instagram or a YouTube channel where you do uh, tarot readings and they know that you actually use your intuition. I'm also hearing, too, that your person is not fucking with you because for the simple fact your intuition is so high, they know you can see right through them. What else do you have for them, Spirit? What's the final outcome in love at this present time for my Leos? Um, stay optimistic about your romance, your romantic life. Um, positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. For those of you who really want your person back, pray. Pray. Pray for a healing that's needed. Um, flirt. Some of you are going to extend your lighthearted energy to other people. That's where we get the new love in. And for others of you, um, someone's going to flirt with you or either you're going to meet a new person or your old person is coming back. Damn. Okay, worth waiting for. So some of you, your person is worth waiting for. That's why I said if you want them back, pray. We have passion here. So there's a lot of passion between the two of you. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. You know this person is the person that does it for you. And uh, let your friends help you. So that's definitely a strong message here because we have it twice. And we have trust. This situation is calling for you guys to have faith because there's heart-to-heart -heart connections. And for some of you, this is definitely your person. Because um, worth waiting for is here as well underneath. So heart-to-heart -heart conversations and release your ex. So some of you, you're going to release this person or your person is going to release you. It's time to clear your energy, family. All right, this concludes your reading, Leos. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, comment, subscribe, share with your family and friends and coworkers. You can find me on Instagram as Ascended Twin 144K. You can find me as Nikita Kelly, Ascended Twin, on Facebook. And you can find me here on YouTube as Ascended Twin, 144K. I love you, my soul fam. Y'all take good care of yourselves. Until the next time we talk, arrivederci. Peace.